Our lead rope still coming through. And as you can see, we've got Mackenzie Brown, Locker. Let's go, Tiani! Here we go. We will be the Division Three Southern Section Champion. The fastest runner in the country this year, both on cross country and track, running very well. Good job, good job. The sophomore from Dana Hills gives the Southern Section Champion. Witnesses to another fantastic historical effort here today with our CIF Southern Section Division II champion Nico Young, Newberry Park, who entered today with the course record and absolutely destroyed that here. 1354.1 was the exact time, 1355. Um, Nico, congratulations. Um, obviously, when you step out on the start line, there's a lot expected of you. Um, expectations because of the things that you've been able to do. Um, just take us through your mindset as you got on the starting line for this race and what you wanted to accomplish um, in terms of executing and getting ready for the next couple of steps to come for you. Yeah, so today was all about um, taking out the race um, pretty fast to string it out more to give um, my teammates a good um, like chance to get out fast. So. Um, yeah, so I, I took it out pretty fast. Um, after that, I kind of, um, the plan was not to really like completely destroy myself today. So I kind of just like, um, after that point, I got it out fast, like where I wanted to be, as where I wanted to be. And after that point, I kind of just um, went in, yeah, probably kicked it in a little bit, but yeah. Now, obviously you want to build a, build a nice base for mm -hmm. the next races to come, yeah. but you want to go out and have a good performance here today, yeah. and obviously we're able to do that. Um, what's the level of satisfaction you have knowing that you did obviously very well here, but you still have a lot left in the tank for Woodward Park and yeah. what's to come after that? Yeah, it's definitely um, relieving to know that um, we, I've got a lot left, and so does the team. That's our plan. Um, we want to peak at nationals that's that's the goal so um yeah we just got to get we got to get through these rounds and then make it there now you mentioned the team aspect obviously another important aspect of what you're out here doing trying to not only have individual yeah. success but lead the team to another state championship um how did you feel you did that today um and what do you think as a team you guys are going to have to continue to build upon from this performance here yeah so um next weekend at the state meet we're going to have to go um harder than we went today probably um nothing's given we still got to put in a really really hard effort and then um just give it all we got at nationals so obviously that will be the big focus but the individual yeah. focus will be on you know what you can do and mm -hmm. obviously challenging course records at Woodward yeah. Park obviously one of the most revered mm -hmm. courses in the United States um that particular mark is one that a lot of people figure would be tough to beat and you know we'll mm -hmm. see if it happens the way you were able to run here today suggests that you have a good opportunity to put your name on the top of that. Is that any part of your focus for next week, or is it more just doing what I need to do to help lead this team and to have a quality race getting ready for nationals? I think it's more towards um, having a quality race to get ready for nationals because um, if I like the course record there is um, extremely fast. If I if I like put my body through that much next weekend, I probably won't be at my top performance at nationals so i'm gonna um definitely it's gonna be fast but um the course record isn't really um, a goal for next weekend so in terms of physical preparation at this time of year you know everybody is, is their fitness level is high and this and that um how are you feeling in terms of where you need to be in order to execute um great races for the next two weeks in terms of physical prowess um i, th I think we uh, manage that really well we'll um We've begun our tapering process, and um, we'll, we should start feeling even better next week and even better the next week. So. And then finally, the expectation levels like I, we talked about earlier, obviously very high every time you start. How do you push all of that aside and prepare normally for next week and then obviously on to nationals after that? Well, I have to really know my own ability and also like what my um, coach uh, believes in me doing. So. Um, Really knowing just like myself and how good I think I can do, I can kind of um, push away um, other expectations that people have set for me. So. Well, the expectations yeah. come <laughs> because of the results. Yeah. And congratulations Thank again. You. A new Riverside City cross-country course record here today, 1354.1 for our Southern Section Division II champion for the second year in a row, Nico Young of Newberry Park. Congratulations, Nico. Thank you.